Yesterday we asked you guys what character, what animal we should draw next from Minecraft. Do you, do you know what they voted on the most? A panda. Yeah, a panda. And I thought that would be a lot of fun to draw a panda today. We're going to draw him sitting and eating bamboo or cake? No, cake. Cake. Let's draw him eating cake. <laughs> we hope you're going to follow along with us. You need something to draw with. We're going to use markers, some paper, and... Something to color with. All right, let's get started. Bamboo. Let's first start by drawing a square for the panda's head. We're going to start by drawing a big letter L. We draw a line down and over this is for the side and the bottom of our square. There we go. And then we want both of these lines to be the same length to make a square. So now we're going to draw an upside down L to draw the top and the other side connecting and making our square. Good job. Now let's draw his nose. We're going to draw a line up, over, and back down. Now inside of this rectangle for his nose, this is actually his snout. Let's draw a smaller rectangle at the top. This is for his nose. At the very bottom, let's draw another little square sticking out the bottom. Now we're going to color that whole shape in black at the end. Let's draw his eyes next. Right here we're going to draw a rectangle shape that comes up, over, back down, and then connect it in. So a rectangle over his nose. We can start right here, go up, over, down, and then connect it back in. Yeah! Now let's do the same thing over here on the other side. And we want to draw the same height, so we'll go up over, down, connect it back in. Now right here in the middle we're going to draw a line straight down for his pupils. Alright, we did it! Well, we're not completely done. Yeah. Now, we, <laughs> now we need to draw, let's draw his ears next. We'll start up here and we're going to draw a line that comes up. Let's draw it on both sides. We'll draw a line over here also. Then on each ear let's draw the line over the top and we're going to go past his head. We'll do the same thing over here. Then we're going to come down and then connect it into his head. Down and then connect in. Well, I have big ears. I like it. He looks awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. The panda ears are really big. Okay, now let's draw the patches over his eyes. We're first going to start right here where his nose is and we're going to go up. We're going to go above his eye and then we'll come across all the way to the side of his head. Now let's do the same thing on the other side. Start on his nose, up and over the top of his eye. Good! Now on the side of his nose we're going to draw a short line and then we'll draw a short line down. It's going to look like stairs. Down, over, then go down again, over, and then down. you can just connect it in if you want. Right there. Yeah! Now let's repeat that same step over here on the other side. Go over, down, over, down, and over. Next, on the top of each patch, we're going to draw another rectangle shape on top of the patch. Now the whole patch is going to be colored black. So even this little line right here we won't see because we'll be coloring that part in. So let's create another small rectangle on the left eye. Now this next part, we're going to color in each of these shapes on his face and also his ears and his nose. We are going to fast forward this part, so you guys at home, remember to pause the video to take that extra time to color in your panda. You ready to fast forward? Yeah! Now we're ready to draw the panda's body. Let's first draw a big rectangle shape. We'll start over here and we're going to draw a line that comes out on both sides of his head bottom of his head. Yeah! Then we're going to draw a big line that comes down on both sides. <laughs> then we're going to draw a line to connect these two. And I'm going to actually turn my paper this way just to make that line a little easier to draw. Alright! Next we're going to draw the cake that he's eating. Does that sound like fun? Yeah! Alright. And we're going to start by drawing a curve right here at the top next to his mouth. Upside down, looks like a frowny face. Okay, and then right here we're going to draw 
a line coming down on both sides. And then at the bottom, we're gonna connect with a curve going the other way. Now we're gonna draw the details or the frosting on our cake. Let's first start by drawing a line comes in and then down, short line. Yeah, and then we'll draw another line that comes in. Then we'll draw another line down and then across. Okay, now we're gonna go back up. Go up and over and then down, over. <laughs> and then we're gonna do the stairs that go all the way to the edge. All right, there's the little frosting drips coming off of the side of our cake. Let's draw the sprinkles on our cake. We'll draw little squares and you can just put them wherever you want. You can add those little squares wherever. Now, if this part, if we're going too fast, remember to pause the video if you need extra time. Okay, now let's draw his arms hanging onto the cake. Let's draw a line that comes out, down, and back in. So it comes out from the cake, down, and back in. Let's repeat that same shape on the other side. Let's go out, down, and then connect back into the cake. Okay, now we can connect the lines to a shoulder. So let's connect that corner to a shoulder. We can reconnect this line over to his shoulder also. And then we'll do this corner down here. Let's connect it to the side of his body. And we can do the same over here on this side. And then two more lines. So go, yeah, go ahead and connect it all the way. There you go. And then right here, we're gonna connect or draw another diagonal line on each side for the top of his arm. <laughs> I'm now hungry because I want Minecraft cake. <laughs> What should we draw next? His legs. His legs. Right here we're gonna draw two lines. They're about that tall. Yeah, and then we're gonna draw a line that comes out and goes past. Then we can go down and then connect it back into his body. Let's do that same line over here. Draw a line that comes out down and then connect it back into his body. There's his legs, he's sitting down and then right here he has a patch that goes across his waist that's black and also a patch up here on his chest. All right, Hadley, we're almost done, but I think because we gave him some cake, what else should we draw? Hearts. Hearts, that means he what? He likes it. He likes the cake? Yeah. Okay. okay. Let's draw a Minecraft heart. So we're gonna draw a lot of uh, straight lines instead of curved lines. Right here, let's draw a big heart. So we'll draw a line across first. Now on both sides of this line, we're gonna draw a line up, over, and down. Okay, now let's do the same thing on the other side. Up, over, and down. Now we're gonna repeat this same step, but watch this, we're gonna go a short line out, long line down, and then a short line in. Then repeat that on the other side, except going the other direction. Yeah, you did it. Then we're gonna draw steps coming down. And then when we get down to the bottom or the middle of the heart, we're gonna start going back up with stairs. Yeah, and then you can go draw stairs to connect. You did it. Let's use those same steps to create another heart on the right side. But this time, let's make a smaller heart. So small line, then let's go up over and down. Repeat that on the same, on the left side, same step on the left side. Then we're gonna draw short line, long line down, short line in. And then the same thing on the other side. What's the next step? The stairs. The stairs. Let's draw stairs going down until we get to the middle and then go back up with stairs going up. All right, Hallie, we did it. We finished drawing our panda that loves his cake. And we still need to do one more thing. What is it? Color it. Yeah, we need to color our panda. This part we're gonna fast forward one more time, but at the end, you guys can pause the video to match the same color. Are you ready to fast forward? Yeah. Have a great job on coloring your panda. I love your drawing the most. I especially love the little hearts and the cake. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> now, if 
our art friends want to, they could change uh, the drawings so that it's not cake he's eating, right? Yeah. W what else does he like to eat? Bamboo. Bamboo. That's where you find them is in the forest of bamboo, right? Yes. <laughs> we hope you had a lot of fun drawing your pandas. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hey, parents and teachers, join our monthly membership and download our app. You can watch all of our art lessons in a safe, distraction-free environment. In the app, you can also download lessons to watch without any Wi-Fi connection. Just visit artforkidshub.tv to join.